Six officials from the office of the Prime Minister returned to the anti-corruption court today, presided over by Grade 1 Magistrate Abbott Asimwe, two days after they were first charged and remanded to Luzira prisons. The six are facing charges of embezzlement, abuse of office and causing financial loss for failing to account for over 4 billion shillings meant for peace-building initiative and involvement in Karamoja subregion. Today, the lawyer for one of the accused, who is yet to appear before court, is Geoffrey Seremba, an accounting officer, explained why his client is yet to show up before the magistrate. Seremba is accused of clearing over 4 billion shillings without a clear plan for the money. General weakness. Profuse diarrhea. We feared to present him in that kind of condition as it would cause court interruptions. He's directed to appear in court for pre taking without fail on Wednesday, 21st June 2023. Should he fail to attend, court will be left to his limited options but to issue a warrant of arrest against him. After this, Defense lawyers asked court to consider releasing one of the suspects, Barbara Asasira, a principal assistant secretary in the same office, as she left behind a two-year-old baby unattended to when she was remanded. The accused person, A4, is released on a cash bail of Uganda shillings 10 million for purposes of attending to the child, which obligation would continue to be violated if she was to wait until all applications are made. Uh, A6 is released on a cash bail of 4 million and each surety is bonded in the sum of Uganda shilling 30 million, not cash. The defense team then submitted bail applications for their clients by representing sureties who court found substantive. Given the economic hardship that is prevailing currently, <laughs> let the bail be something that my client is able to raise. And I would pray that a bail of 3 million shillings, my own. <laughs> A2 is released on a cash bail of Uganda shillings 20 million, and sureties are bonded in the sum of 100 million, not cash. A2, A3 is released on a cash bail of 20 million, and each surety is bonded in the sum of 100 million, not cash. Magistrate Abbott Asimi delivered a specially tough bail conditions. Each of the accused persons shall surrender their original passports to court and shall not leave this country without knowledge and permission of this court. Until we meet when we next meet. Thank you. The accused are expected back in court on the 26th of July 2023 for mention of the case. The magistrate has warned the suspects against frequenting their places of work during this time of trial and that they should also desist interfering with investigations that are being carried out by the IGG. He also reminded the IGG to bring this to the attention of public service to interdict these suspects using the standing orders. Sudil Yaruhanga, NTV at the Anti-Corruption Court in Colombia.